So how long have you been a nurse? A little over a year. I just graduated um, in May last year. Yay, COVID. All the baby nurses that have survived the pandemic. It's been rough, though. I bet. I bet. It's been... been Ugh, I don't even know where to begin. Yeah. <laughs> it's just been, what a year to become a nurse, honestly. It has, yeah. Um, you know, I knew that I wanted to do nursing way before, because I've worked in the medical field off and on for years and years. And I actually worked with a cardiologist as her office manager. And just seeing her bedside manner and the way she talked to patients, I knew instantly that I wanted to go into nursing school. She's amazing. She knows that she was a huge influence. Oh right? yeah, okay. she she even was going to be, was going to pin me for nursing school. Yeah, Aww. I took her to breakfast one day and asked her if she would, be, if she would pin me. She started crying uncontrollably. <laughs> How about you, what if? Oh, so I've been a nurse since 2002. Um, so almost 20 years. That's awesome. I was an LPN first. Okay. Um, for almost 16 years and then I came here I've done a lot of different things mm-hmm. labor and delivery in a rural hospital oh. um, advantage case management which is a Medicaid waiver program in the community for 11 years mm-hmm. um, then here yeah I've done some I've done a little bit of office you know like clinic stuff mm-hmm. um, here and there filling and stuff yeah I came here in 16 2016 while I was finishing my gen eds um, to the floor to yeah. 10 to a med search floor and finished school up there. Went to my R, finished my RN, then mm-hmm. to my BSN. Um, and yeah, I'm still here. Yeah. I right now am in the heart station, in oh, the cardiac, okay. one of the cardiac procedural oh, okay. areas. Got it. I'm going back to the floor as a charge nurse. Oh, next okay. Week. That's right. You did say that. Yes. Sorry. Um, Long day. It's Please okay. forgive me. <laughs> I, I thought I wanted the structure of procedural. It's the same thing, Monday through Friday, in and out. Yeah. No crazy patient with the code brown, you know, yeah. all the things. Yeah. Um, and I honestly realized I missed the chaos of yeah, the floor. Yeah, really? I mean, I've got, I'm older <sighs> and, you know, in my upper 40s and I was like, bedside nursing, I've got to find another thing, right? Like my body can't handle it. Yeah, yeah. However, I really like it and I really missed it. Yeah. I didn't realize how much I missed it. Um, I learned a ton of things. Yes. Um, in the heart station, I think that are going to be great to take back to the floor. Yes. To teach the nurses so that they understand what's happening in the procedural wise. areas better. Because mm-hmm. on the floor, you don't know that business. You the, the, the transporter comes, picks them up, takes them, and they come back. You're like, okay, I don't know what just happened, sure, but they had let me look at the notes. Yeah, yeah. What did the notes say? <laughs> yeah. They'll tell me everything. But I thought I was needed a break from that long time that you have with a 12-hour shift with your patient. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I really miss it. There's yeah. so much you can teach them and that you can, there's so much you can do for them in that time frame. Oh, yeah, definitely. And so I really missed that. Yeah.